Hello, um, today I'm going to be showing you a, um, this is what I call the Glader Tunnel, because if you've watched the Maze Runner, at the, uh, at the end of the Maze Runner, there is, um, um, so the Gladers, they go down the chute, and there's a tunnel that lights up like boom, 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 and, um, I decided, I thought that looked very cool, so I decided to make a creation based off that. So, right here, I just have a normal step lock door. Um, if you want to see that, maybe I'll put another video about that. So, what it basically does is when you step on the first pressure plate, it activates a series of step lock commands, which turn that into air. And when you activate those, it turns that into that. So, like, as you can see, it turns it in air. And then that turns it into, yeah. So, anyways. Then, you, you have to flick it twice, the lights turn on, um, then, when you get to the end, you're, um, also able to, you have to flick it twice, unfortunately, and then, it starts, oh no, 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 let me escape from the dark, that was also a step lock door right there, so, maybe let me go into a bit of the redstone behind this. So, when you go in here, um, you probably already know this, that is constantly being powered, that, so that's already powered, that's pretty simple, that's a redstone lamp. Now, when you go into there, that, um, there's redstone leading down from under it. Hey, the, yeah, yeah, there's redstone leading down from under it. To activate, sip lock commands, which turn the door into air, then, when you go past it, um, there's redstone b under that, which triggers commands, which turn it into back to diamond blocks again. Um, so, um, then, here's the interesting part. You might think that this lighting up part has to do with so much redstone, but if you look at the Outside, actually, it's not that much redstone, I don't think. It's, it's actually very, very little redstone. Um, I had an older prototype of it. That wasn't even the same one. And this one involved quite a lot of redstone for actually turning off the lights. That was ridiculous. And I didn't want to record that all of that. Anyway, because it hardly ever works. You have to end up go out of the place of redstone block and then break it at the place, yeah. So, basically, um, you activate this, you know, twice again. As you can see, it turns on those. That's actually extremely simple. That's all the stuff up here. So, basically, um, let me just turn on. Pod flicking it up once. What it does is it um sends a signal off from here. By the way, that replaces that redstone wire. Oh, for some reason it's glitching like that. Alright. Um anyways. So what it does is it goes up here, then it has a little timing thing which also repeats it, repeaters, at a time and it waits a bit before activating each light. That yeah, that would that was pretty simple. So it also replaces that because in the process of that it breaks it. So basically, now how the turning off mechanism works. So how it does that is um when the lever is activated, it does a signal right here, which turns that block which is all the way over here, right, right here, to air. So the connection is broken, it turns off the lights. That's why that creates it when you flick the odd lever. Um, so basically, I think I already explained to you how the set block doors work. That's basically how it works in a nutshell. Uh, maybe if we could get either, uh, uh, I think this might be in my first video. Maybe we could either get 
100, maybe 150 views on this in like um, one and a half months, maybe. Uh, no, in like two months. If we could get 100, if we could get 150 views on this in two months, then maybe I'll make a tutorial for this. Um, so you guys could see how I made this and how you guys can make it in your normal Minecraft world. It just makes life easier, I think. So, um, or maybe instead of 150 views, if we reach um, 20 likes on this by two months, then I guess I'll also post a tutorial. So, thank you guys for watching. Um, this has been Palmer 99 and I'm out.